I mean, they, they play small ball um, for the majority of the game. Um, so I thought uh, it was just good for us to attack and get to the rim. Uh, you know, usually we're one shot blocker. That creates so much, uh, you know, ball movement on the perimeter. And uh, we did a good job of swinging it tonight. It's a good confidence win right here, uh, especially um, against a team that we might see in the playoffs. Um, you know, we, we didn't get a full look with LeBron being out, but we got a glimpse of how this team would guard us. And, um, you know, that's good to go for it. Your bench put up 50 points. How important is it to have that kind of depth, especially at this point in the season? It's huge. Uh, we're going to need everybody in this group. Uh, it's going to be nice for our starting five. It's not playing well. We need our bench to step up. Um, but, again, I thought both uh, units were clicking tonight. And, um, again, it's, it's the confidence. We play with confidence. We're good. It, matter. it doesn't matter who's on the floor. We, uh, every, win, every game is important to us. So uh, I think we did a better job of executing in the fourth quarter today. You know, um, even without LeBron, they're still – you have two all-stars out there on the court. Um, they're going to they're gonna shoot the ball. They're going to execute their plays. They're playing at a faster pace. And this is a potential team that we could see in the playoffs. So um, any, any type of team that we can play and execute and run our stuff against, protect home court, I think it's all building blocks. You're still seventh in the East and you're facing Toronto coming up. What kind of matchup does that pose? Because that legitimately will be, if you stay in the same spot, who you face in the playoffs. Yeah, um, they're definitely an aggressive team. Uh, we have to really watch film, a lot of film. They was at the free throw line a, a lot more than we would want. Uh, Biombo played great against us. Uh, I think we have to just key in on some of the things that they did. You know, DeMar, pick and roll, Biombo at, uh, in front of the rim, um, Kyle Lowry. I think if we just get back to what we're doing defensively, um, I think we can be okay. That second unit, is, is, it, it could be special. You know, Stucky out there, you know, Ty out there, the way our ability to run, Miles in the post and his ability to run, that can definitely be a, a, a game-changing unit. I think in the past couple of games, we've really been the, the unit to really kind of uh, push our lead a little bit ahead. I've just been working. Like I said, I've been trying to get, just get my legs back under me, get a rhythm, just, you know, coming back from the injury, missing almost, well, a little bit over a month of time, being off and on, you know, and just playing my way into it. Been able to play my way into getting more minutes because I've been able to play better, and now I'm just finding the rhythm. What does a win like this do for you guys moving forward, especially against a potential playoff matchup? Um, it just continues to create belief in what we're trying to do, what we can do. And they can say, you know, Brian didn't play, whatever, whatever, but they're still a good team, and it's still good for our morale heading into the stretch, the home stretch, and get ready for the playoffs. We got a lot of things we're trying to clean up. A lot of guys find a rhythm in roles. Um, we kind of. Hurts that we didn't have tie tonight just because, you know, getting them some more rhythm, some more game minutes. But at the same time, it shows that we can pick up the slack. So I think it's just about us continuing to focus on us, what we control, what we can do every day in practice to keep working.